There was a time when track and field stars looked towards pole vault as a glamour event rather than the sprints or the long distance races. That was the era of Sergei Bubka. In all probability that time, the visual of the perfect vault has once again returned with another European called Armand Duplantis. We have seen many great moments in the Olympics like Jesse Owens winning four medals at the Olympics in 1936. Jim Thorpe becoming the first Native American to win a gold medal for the United States in the 1912 Stockholm Olympics. 1976 Montreal was special for gymnast Nikolai Andrianov. Mark Spitz winning seven gold medals at the 1972 Munich Olympics. Team India's domination in field hockey from 1928 to 56, winning six straight gold medals. Carl Lewis clinching four medals at the 1984 Olympics in Los Angeles. And who can ever forget Michael Phelps' supremacy at the 2008 Beijing Olympics and many more. In the much-awaited Tokyo Olympics, will American sweet star Armand Duplantis climb the podium to win the gold and bring the pole vault back into the spotlight? Athletics runs in Armand Duplantis' family. His father was a former pole vaulter and his mother was a former heptathlete and volleyball player. His two older brothers and his younger sister also took sports as a career. Duplantis was very talented since childhood, winning many accolades, including the World Youth Championships in 2015, the European Junior Championships in 2017, and the World Junior Championships in 2018. As a citizen of both the United States and Sweden, he could have chosen to represent pole vault for either country internationally, but in 2015, he chose Sweden. Duplantis is a current world record holder with a height of 6.18 meters, created at the World Athletics Indoor Tour in Glasgow in 2020. Sergei Bubka, the legendary pole vaulter, shattered the world record 17 times in 10 years in the 80s and 90s. It then took 20 years for Renault Lavilny of France to break Bubka's record with a clearance at 6.16 meters. And now Sweden's Armand Duplantis has broken the world record twice last year. Duplantis won silver in the World Championship in 2019 in Doha. A few days back, Duplantis discussed his Tokyo Olympics preparation with pole vault great Sergei Bubka. It's good. I'm just starting back right now to training from the indoor season. I took a week off. I feel good. I'm healthy. So I think that's the most important thing. And I have a couple of months before my next competition. So just trying to stay healthy and get in some good shape before the outdoor season. Duplantis also spoke about the world record and his goal. Of course, I want to jump as high as possible, but a really important thing for me now in my career is I want to win the championship meets. I came up a little short in 2019. I was second in the world championships. And so, of course, that's a meet that I want to win and to win several times. I think the big goal right now is the Olympics. It's the biggest event in track and field. It's the pinnacle of our sport. So I want to go in there and I want to be able to come away with the gold because I think it's just really important if you want to leave your legacy as one of the best pole vaulters to live. When Duplantis broke the world record last year, Sergei Bubka congratulated him on Twitter and he also said, This is great what you did and I believe for the future it is also possible to jump higher. I understand that the Olympic Games is a very important event for you and of course I wish you good luck in the Olympics because this is something unique. There is nothing to compare with the Olympic Games.